I actually was really scared to launch the business. I was scared of failure as a lot of business owners are, um, but I'm so glad that I did. We are not living to work, we are working to live, and this, this was our way to do it. There's so many emotions that come to mind when I think about starting my business. I was definitely excited, but even more so scared and petrified because I really wasn't sure what I was doing. I know there was a need for empathy in the transportation industry. And as someone who always puts people first, I knew I could provide that area of need. But I love it. I wouldn't change it for the world. And I'm absolutely proud of where we are today. Small business is the backbone of your community. That is the everyday person who is generating those sales receipts, generating the sales tax, or generating paychecks for people who are going out and spending their money in town. Follow your heart. If you have a passion for something, don't second guess that passion. If you have an idea that you think is crazy, but something inside of you is saying to do it, do it. We're here to follow our passion, follow our joy. It's amazing when you do that, the pieces fall into place. There is no rule book as to what to do, so you definitely have to look out for resources, which I was able to do with the SBDC. It's amazing free. It's highly intelligent, highly educated industry folks. These are not people that, oh, this is my first job. These are folks that had jobs in that specific industry and then came back to teach other people and are solely, their sole purpose is to make you successful have people and mentors in your corner. Um, Apex was a great tool and resource for me um, to grow my business. The Florida SBDC has been an incredible resource for our business. It's been a priceless resource and it's here for everyone. That's what's so beautiful. It's here for everyone. So if you have a passion and you have an idea, don't second guess yourself, just go for it. Follow your heart because when your heart is tugging at you, it's telling you something.